Hey, what's going on everybody? Ryan Fay from Wolfen and Body Company. Today on Tech Talk, we're gonna be doing an overview of the fuel system. Um, Drew's gonna be showing us kind of each component, how they work together, what they look like separate, and what they look like on a body as well. So let's go check it out and see what he's up to. Where is he at? Sensor on the wrong engine, and we'll throw fuel pressure. There he out is. Of range high, right? Yo, Drew. Right. What's going on? I'm not too much today. We're going to do a uh, a breakdown of the fuel system on a 2010 emissions DT. Sounds super interesting. Tell, it's definitely going to be interesting. Tell me more. Tell me more. It's definitely going to be helpful for a lot of customers here. So, um, anyway. These are your most major uh, parts of the fuel system that I can actually bring out on the table. The other part would be an intake manifold, which I have on the head over there. So anyway, you have your fuel header here. You have your DSI, your downstream injector. I even have the fuel line attached, special delivery there. Okay. And then your uh, downstream injector, and then we have your injectors out. So it's pretty cool um, seeing it all out like this. Seems, seems pretty cool. Yeah, seems pretty, pretty cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So anyway. I actually do have a, uh, a breakdown of a, it's a coffee table book which explains everything. So anyway, I forgot the part, so he's going to bring the part over. Grab the part, grab the part. <laughs> Alright, so I'll do that. It's alright guys, we're he's got his parts. we a whole blooper reel for this. So anyway, what I'm doing is I, I'm bringing it over to this head, mm -hmm. so you can see how it all operates when it's on the head and broken down. So I'm actually a strong believer in just tear it apart and you'll you'll know how it all works. So anyway. Rule number one, guys. Your fuel header, it bolts to your intake manifold. And on the back of this header, there's an O-ring. This is what supplies the fuel into your intake manifold. Okay. And your intake manifold distributes the fuel to your fuel injectors which are in the head and there's ports in this intake manifold that run through the head to allow fuel to get to your injectors. So at the back of your intake manifold, at the back of your fuel rifle here, mm -hmm. there is a DSI metering unit, which bolts up like this. So your, your fuel would come out here, your fuel delivery pressure would go into your DSI unit. Your yep. DSI metering unit, um, during regen, it's gonna send fuel down this fuel line, which goes to this, DSI injector which shoots fuel down into the exhaust to allow the exhaust to heat up for regen purposes. So that's what it looks like on a head. Mm -hmm. Very easy to understand it here. But I have a vehicle at the end of my bay which I can explain. Show what it looks like on so we, the vehicle. It's, it's going to be much more difficult to see it on the vehicle but seeing it on the vehicle is the best way to understand it. Alright, show me. So, um, let's see. Actually, we'll I'll actually cut through here. You can see we got a rebuild process here. Kinda Bunch cool. of parts. Kind kind of cool. Our daily grind here. A nice breezy day at Wolfington. It's actually a beautiful day today. Beautiful day. We're beating the heat today. I literally grabbed the prettiest DT on our lot, which is which is actually it's, it's a beautiful end today. It's actually got some new components on it. So anyway, this is the header that's already attached. So this is your fuel line in from the tank, mm -hmm. fuel, fuel supply. There's your fuel return, the gray line. And then on this header, you got a couple sensors. You got your whip sensor. You have your fuel delivery pressure sensor here. I don't know if the camera's gonna pick it up. I'll shine my light on it. There's your fuel delivery pressure sensor there. Got and it. then here's your fuel heater. And then your intake manifold is all right here. Looks like a lot more once it's all installed, but it's still pretty simple. Mm -hmm. And then if we come around, I can show you the DSI and the injector and, and how it's located. So there's your DSI metering unit, which bolts to the back of that intake manifold. And then there's the fuel, fuel line that goes all the way to your downstream injector right there, which is mounted in your exhaust brake elbow. Okay, I see it, I see it. So that's what it's like. And hopefully seeing it this way, it breaks it down. So, you know, Makes the technicians it, can understand yeah. easily how this works. Makes it easier on me too. Now I know where it's kind of located in the bus as well. Hopefully it helps you guys. So anyway, that is a brief, brief description of the whole fuel system. Mm -hmm. um, 
So if you join us next week, I actually will break down that header. Um, I'll you know explain more into that header and you know quick, easy diagnostic steps for that header. Awesome. See you next week, guys. Good stuff. See you later, Joe. Hey guys, thanks for tuning in today on uh, the Tech Talk. I really appreciate it. I hope you enjoyed the content. If you guys could, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell, and go follow us on all of our social media at Wolfington Body Company. If you guys would like, shoot a comment down below. We're taking requests on making some videos. If you guys wanna see something new, you wanna see Drew do something out of the ordinary, um, please shoot a comment down below and we'll get to that. I hope you guys enjoy this content and we'll see you on next week's episode. All right.